I stood in this very spot at Bethune Cookman about two weeks ago, and students then told me they are fed up and they want change. They made progress fast. Now they're getting national attention. Roland Martin is a journalist, the founder of the Black Star Network, and the host of a show called Unfiltered. He flew in from Washington, D.C. to host this town hall. This is not about tearing down with Bethune Cookman. This is not about trying to shut folks down. It's about how do we improve one of our institutions to make it stronger for the students, for the faculty, staff, as well as for the alumni. Students say there is a lot to improve. Dozens have shared stories not just of mold, but of rats, lack of AC, and conditions that have their parents telling them to get out while they can. Not only does the mold sits on our walls, we shower in, we breathe in from the arrogance, it really sits in every crack and crevice in the dorms. During the town hall, Martin also aired a pre-recorded interview with VCU's interim president, Dr. Lawrence Drake. Dr. Drake admitted communication between administration and students needs to improve. He says he's been talking with the school's third-party vendors to improve food service and that he's been working things out with the Alumni Association. But when Dr. Drake blamed housing conditions on the hurricanes, he was met with boos and outcries from the crowd. Bethune Cookman's president says he's investing $10 million to make improvements on the buildings here. He says of 100 buildings on the campus, 60 need repairs. In Daytona, Marie Edinger, Fox 35 News.